can't stay. I'm chaperoning my daughter's Girl Scout dinner in 45 minutes. Well, tuck me into your waistband and try not to pee up your shirt. Oh, boy. All right, I think I found the culprit. This shrimp was lodged under one of your gums. Wow, that must have been in there a while. It's been weeks since I ordered from Hurry Up Shrimp. <sighs> Where the hell is this guy? I ordered... You got all a sense of wonder that I somehow lost. I got so used to watching TV and looking for tiny gene fibers in my nuts, I forgot there's a whole world out there to experience. Thank you for showing me that. And as far as I'm concerned, you're a permanent part of our family now. Well, that sure is nice of you, Peter. But there's a big old world out there. I want to go out and experience it for myself. Oh. You missed. Oh, what's the matter, Mike? Can't punch a girl in the face? You'd be surprised what my face can do to you. Okay, Brian, I'm just putting this out there, but I'm a baby, and only dicks don't let babies win. God, look at this day, huh? You know, usually I'd be sitting inside writing, you'd be working on one of your machines, but here we are enjoying it. Yes, it is a nice change of pace. Oh, wait, I gotta go grab my knee pads. I was using them for, for, for this other thing. Anyway, I'll be right back. Brian, look out! The street that a broad can smell on a fire escape. There's got to be an explanation for this. Let's ask that security guard who has everything on his belt except a gun. A excuse me, sir? It's officer. No, it's not. It's barely, sir. Yeah, I know. Where is the Christmas carnival? Cancelled. I don't know why. I'm just a small cog in this operation. You hear that, Dad? You're not the only one around here with a small cog. I, I told, told you, you that, that in confidence, Chris. Chris. Daddy, where's Santa? Not the captain's responsibility. Well, maybe not where you come from, but here on the love boat. Now, who is Mr. Devlin? Try skinny dipping with her like when you were kids. Hey, Lois, if I was going to kill myself, do I slit my wrists this way or this way? Sideways for attention, long way for results. Meg is right. Okay, I'll be in the garage. Peter, put that knife down. Lois, I don't have any friends, so I'm going to kill myself and get a full page in the yearbook. Then they that's what I can do for the company. Really? Can you do other things for the company? No, 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 I don't want to be promoted that way. I want to be promoted to shooting hawks with a crossbow way. The NFL experience? That sounds cool. Kid, you're the best. Sign with me and you're gonna make millions. Griffin, get out there! Ow! It's his knee. Doc! You'll never play football again. Too bad, kid. You was gonna buy me a house! Now I have... And now, an opening statement from our second candidate, the king of the zingers, Chris Griffin. Yeah! Go easy on me, Chris. My sister has MS. <laughs> I'm worried what you're gonna do with her. I'm out. I'm not running. And neither is she. I knew you'd have something. No, you don't understand. I'm dropping out of the election. I'm a big fraud, and I'm treated people. I gotta wonder, and I'm sure you do too, how this thing didn't crack when they were carving out her downstairs business. He did a great job with the vagina. Here's a picture by this guy, Salvador Dali. This guy, I'm telling you, was a freaking wackadoodle. Wow, who knew you could learn so much at a museum? And this is only Chicago. From now on, I'm gonna volunteer for every business trip and see all the great stuff that's out there. Hey, remember when you swallowed that ribeye bone and you couldn't poop it out? And then you pushed real hard and the poo came through the ribeye hole? Peter, we gotta go over there and talk to Donna. All right, but you need to cool down first, Lois. Find a way to channel your anger. What I do is throw a shot put into a crowd and make it look like an accident. Oh! I forgot to make it look like an accident. 